German MEP Martin Schulz campaigned to become European Commission president on a platform of ending backroom deals in the EU. But it was just that kind of agreement that saw him re-elected as the head of the European Parliament earlier. A democracy can only be built according to this rule, on the basis of respect and human dignity. And whoever calls into question these rules of mutual respect and human dignity will face my vigorous opposition. The EPP struck the deal with Schultz's centre-left socialists and Democrats amid the horse trading over the top commission job. But the pro-EU centre-right group rejected accusations of selling out. Well, that is first of all normal democratic uh, behaviour, that we presented during the election campaign our ideas, our, our general directions, and afterwards, when we see we have no one majorities, we have to come together. It will be left to the Greens, the far left and Eurosceptic parties to provide opposition to the Grand Coalition. Some MEPs worry, however, it will mean more of the same especially more austerity. I think it's difficult to establish forms of cooperation with Mr. Schultz, even if he continues to work as he does right now. We'll extend a hand, but the key to this helping hand is ending austerity. Schultz ran against three other candidates. He received 409 votes backing his return to the Speaker's chair. 314 were against or left blank.